Have you ever seen a piece of content that provides you with such intrinsic knowledge about the world that you had to stop and take notes? The recently released web series Scam 1992 on Sony Lip follows the story of the rise of Harshad Mehta from a common man to being referred to as the Amitabh Bachchan of stock exchange and his eventual downfall. The series directed by Jia and Harshal Mehta is based on a book The Scam by Devashish Basu and Sucheta Dalal follows the personal and professional journey of Harshad Mehta alongside the investigative journalism of Sucheta Dalal Before getting started let me give you a basic idea of what went down in 1992 considering Harshad Mehta According to RBI guidelines banks needed to have a specific amount of government securities which they traded amongst each other through brokers One such broker was Harshad Mehta He borrowed from weak banks promising them government securities and from the bigger banks promising them returns much higher than the usual And with all this excess liquidity he easily manipulated the stock exchange according to his own will although things started going downhill when greed took over and he started borrowing large amounts from banks on the basis of government securities that did not exist to learn more about this check out the video in cards or you can also check the description coming to the series the best aspect of this series in my opinion is the amount of quality information that the show provides without being boring The show also takes time to explain the details and intricacies of the massive scale and magnitude of the stakes at hand. The well-paced narrative is then supported by the stellar sound design by Achit Thakur. Also the integration of old Bollywood songs at the end of episode according to the mood of the episodes is an very intelligent decision and it adds to the overall theme and aesthetic of the show. The music along with great set design provide authenticity to the world that the makers of the show are trying to create wherein the seamless integration of the major events during 1990s just is just commendable. The casting of the show is one of the best in my opinion and because the writing is smart every actor gets to perform at their full potential. Shreya Dhan Mantri as Sucheta Dalal is a force to reckon. A fierce journalist who knows how to get her job done no matter what the odds are. Shreya portrays a character of a woman who thrives in a male dominated work environment with such conviction that it seems effortless. Prateek Gandhi who is a well known Gujarati actor is a wonderful find. He embodies the character of Harshad Mehta and does not miss a single beat and the range that he brings to the table is extraordinary. Apart from the two leads the performances that really stood out to me were Anand Mahadev as the RBI governor who brings calm and gravitas to the screen. Nikhil Dwedi and Shadab Khan as the competing players of the market who are always jealous of Harshad Mehta bring authenticity to the world of the story. Jay Upadhyay and an incredible performance is the voice of reason in Harshad Mehta's life. While Sateesh Kaushik as the veteran of the market brings magical comic moments. While I can't possibly name all the actors in the video, all the actors in the series even with the smallest screen time have done an incredible job. The example of shows and movies that actually provide educational value are far and between in the Indian cinema. While this show not only educates the audience about the terminology and inner working of the Indian financial markets but also provides an insight into the human behavior and the intricacies of human mind. The series showcases that nothing in the world is distinct black or white but the world exists on the spectrum of gray. The series also does not demonize Harshad Mehta and provides a nuanced portrayal of a flawed man with insane ambition. The show is available on Sony Live and in my opinion it's totally worth your time. Aur agar aapko ye show acha lagta hai ya fir aap money scam se related koi shows dekhna chahte hain to Bad Boy Billionaires jo ki Netflix par available hai uska third episode bahut hi zyada interesting hai kyunki us case ke bare mein usually public platforms par zyada koi information hai nahi and i think that story is the most interesting of all the three episodes so on that note that is it from me today agar aapko video achhi lagi ho to video ko like kar do share kar do aur channel ko subscribe kar do and jo bhi aapka feedback hai wo aap comment section mein dal sakte hain and i will see you next time until then keep doing what you love bye bye